Okay, so I've officially started my journey with Pride Transport. We'll see how they turn out. My first load heads out to California, Stockton, and it's just a candy load from uh, Hershey's uh, distribution center in uh, Ogden. I made my first pit stop at a rest area over here by the uh, Bonville Salt Flats. I didn't think it was going to be sunny because I just went through a whole bunch of rain and ended up being really cool because uh, the reflections off the water are just amazing. So this is my view here at the, uh, the rest area. Hopefully this company uh, works out a little better than my previous one does because, uh, you know, who doesn't like getting paid? I don't know why, but those lights remind me of uh, like an emergency room. Happy Sunday. Welcome to my new abode. I have storage compartments. Uh, this is a uh, uh, Freightliner now. I don't have a Kenworth anymore, so I'm getting used to some of the features. I've actually got a ladder now. There's a TV. Comes out. Let's show you. Look at that. Yeah. Yeah. Look at all that. And the noise. You like my ladder? Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. That's where I, that's where I hide my, uh, my lot lizards. My trusty air fryer and water boiler. A couple of things I don't like about it. I don't like this gap. This gap, because any, any person could just sit there and start peeping inside my truck. You know, I don't know when I've got my booty hanging out. I don't want people looking at that. It's my wife only. She says so. If you look at the seat, it's just slightly to the right of the steering wheel. My arms are just shifted off to the side a little bit as I'm driving. It's just, you know, those little things, it may not seem like a big deal now, but you sit in that seat for 11 hours a day uh, and that little shift, constant misalignment of your torso is, uh, <clears throat> gets amplified. I think I'm just gonna have to start doing yoga. I can start a yoga channel. I know you guys wanna see that. Trucker's yoga. No, no, you, no. I don't want to see that. Mm -hmm. 